Can you tell us in clinical practice for our patients in menopause, how is testosterone use uh, actually clinically very helpful and meaningful for them? Yeah, absolutely. So the where we see testosterone being used the most and where it's clinically indicated and it's approved by the American College of Endocrinology as well as ISHWISH, as well as the American College of OBGYNs, is in hypoactive sexual desire disorder, otherwise known as low libido. And the way that we use it there is that we will, you know, you draw like baseline testosterone levels and then you repeat those blood levels after a few months, so typically like three to six months. And what you're doing is you give a tenth of the dose. So uh, typically what we can use is there's something that is already available to men. It's called Testem, uh, testosterone. And that one packet of Testem uh, depends on how much is in that packet, but if it has five cc's or five millimeters of testosterone in that one packet, then that one packet can last 10 days for a woman. So she applies a half a cc to the back of the calf every single day for testosterone. And that, of course, will help with the libido. 